we are going to do Philly cheese steak foil packs. There are lots of different ways to do um, a Philly cheese steak foil pack, and there are some people who are going to argue with you about the ingredients. So just use whatever you want to use for you. As with most foil packs, you just want to start with putting a little bit of butter on the bottom of your foil. And now I have some already beef shaved steak to put down. I intend on this going in a bun when it's done, but you don't have to. You could do this over um, potatoes if you want. You could do this over just about anything, or you don't even have to eat it with any kind of starch if you don't want to. And there we go. So a nice thick layer of that shaved steak. Next thing I'm going to add are actually going to be some mozzarella pearls. And this is just fresh mozzarella cheese. Now I'm going to add some minced garlic. Pepper. Herb blend. Um, now a traditional Philly cheese steak would actually have cheese Whiz and onions. But I'm not using Cheese Whiz, so I'm using a really melty cheese called Havarti cheese to go over these mozzarella pearls. Next, I'm going to put peppers and onions. Before I wrapped it up, um, I didn't just want the Havarti cheese to be on top because then it just would have stuck to the top of the foil. So I actually just put another um, thin layer of the shaved steak over the top just to help so that the cheese actually melts down into the rest of the ingredients and doesn't just stick to the top of the foil because then it's useless. So the dogs are going to get some rice, not bread or potatoes, rice. And we're going to give them some of that shaved beef, giving them just a couple mozzarella pearls. Um, daddies, the doggies, two big potatoes ready to go. We're home. You can't tell. Hi. Um, Obviously, we had intended on making these at the campsite when I prepped them, but unfortunately, it rained on us. So this is how much food was in the dog's foil pack. Um, cooked it for about 20 minutes. I just honestly just threw the whole pack and all right in the oven. oven. Okay. You ready to eat your camp meal at home? It was supposed to be campfire. But they cook in the oven just as well as they cook on a campfire, so good to know. You're being impatient. Come on, on your bed. You know where you get your meals. Thank you. He's already... Hey, brat, don't go thinking this means you're going to get food cooked at home all the time. This is special. <coughs> this is only because we couldn't make it at the campsite. Uh -huh.